Yes. It's your boy Lagan24 coming at you with some pistols and knives only on Darice. What's up, everybody? So, pistols and knives, it sounds exactly like what it is. It's going to be me using my pistol and my knife. And let me just go ahead and clarify real quick that I will be using grenades because you have to make crawlers at the end of the rounds. And sometimes you run out of ammo and it's just going to take way too long to kill the zombies once they're strong with uh, just your knife. So, pistols and knives only and grenades. And grenades. So if I get monkey bombs, I'll use those too. Basically any kind of explosive I'm open to using. And that's what I'll be doing. So we'll see how this goes. Fuck you. Basically you want to uh, kind of stay in this first area. I guess for about, I don't know, four rounds or so. You want to get about four or 5,000 points. What kind of sucks about this though is there's no quick revive in this first area. It's over there. So... We're just going to have to wait to get quick revive, which means I'm going to have to be really careful and not go down before then, or my game is over. So what's today? Today is October 15th. It's a Sunday? Monday? Today's Monday. So we're like, what are we, less than a month away from Black Ops 2, and I am excited. Can't wait to get my hands on some of that new zombie stuff. It's going to be great. Seems like they're hyping zombies more than they are the multiplayer at this point. Which is cool. I was playing with some guy the other day who got monkey bombs. And I had no idea what monkey bombs did. So I, gotta, I guess that kind of just shows you that there are new people transitioning over to zombies that normally don't play. And I think that has a lot to do with all the hype surrounding Black Ops 2 zombies. And uh, like I said, I'm excited. I'm ready for it. It's been a couple of videos that Treyarch's posted in regards to zombies that kind of leaves me head scratching a little bit, like the um, the buildable items you can build a riot shield by using a hand truck and a car door, which seems pretty cool. And there's also a ladder, and we don't know how the ladder is going to be used yet, but they showed an image of a ladder and uh, or they showed an actual video of the ladder and the ladder being picked up. But it never showed it combining with anything or being used with anything. So I'm not sure how the ladder is going to be used. But my point to this, I guess, would be hopefully they didn't change so much about the game that we don't like it. And I am happy to report, and you probably already knew this already, but you know, original zombie modes like the one you're watching right now will still be in the game. So if they've completely fucked up zombies with campaign mode and the 4v4, then it's always good to know we can fall back on this. So that double points helped out a little bit. Got me some more monies. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No slapping. Get off. I want to kill you more. And Doris has a dog round. I'm super happy about that because that means every five rounds or so, I'll get max ammo. Oh, it was perfect. Oh, and a max ammo? Doing good. I'll drink to that. Well, I'll drink to anything. All right, round four, pistols and knives. We're doing it. We're doing it. I don't know what a good round of pistols and knives is. Um, I usually don't record when I play pistols and knives. It's usually when I'm bored and I just kind of want to see how far I can get. I, I know I've been in the 30s. Uh, a few times playing pistols and knives. And the biggest challenge you have is the first thing, getting set up with pistols and knives. Sometimes can be a real bitch. Um, because you can go to that box and you can spend your money on that box 10 to 15 times without getting a pistol or a knife. But I am playing this on Black Ops, so it increases my chances definitely because I'll have what what's in the box? The CZ75, the CZ75 Akimbo, the Python. And even the ballistic knives are good through about 12 rounds or so. And I'll also try to get that Bowie knife, which will be helpful. So I got me a crawler going, and let me kill this guy. Ooh, I hear more zombies. Nope, just... Oh, there he is, okay. So, 
and kill these guys. Then we'll go to the box, I think. Die, zombie. Yeah, so plenty, plenty of points. So let's head over to the box. So I hope the I hope that the original characters, Nikolai, Rick Toffin, Dempsey, Takio, I hope they're all in the game. I mean, they've shown a bunch of footage with new characters, but I hope the traditional mode still has my boys in it. Because they'd be funny. I'm looking for that Bowie knife. Just keep an eye out for that. I'm not quite sure if this map even has one. Because I just can't remember off the top of my head where it's at. Well, let's do this. Turn on the power. Can I get lucky? No. Let me go see if we can get quick revive while we're here. Alright, that's good. Alright, let's get one more spin. Come on, baby. No whammies, no whammies, and stop. Yes! Fuck yeah. Now you could try that literally. I don't even know. You could just sit there for days doing that shit. You're dead. Alright. Well, this is a good start. We got a quick revive. We've got a gun. I am happy. Ooh, here comes the dogs. The foul beast approach. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, shit, they're hard to hit with this gun. There we go. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Don't die. Don't die. Okay, we're healed. There we go. Nice. I'm pretty much going to start every single round in this area. My goal is to get the zombies to come out all over here by this area. And then I'll start a rave train around the map. But i got to open up some more of the map before I can do that. It's only round six. We shouldn't have any problems in this area. And you always feel a little safer once you got quick revive. It take chances you normally wouldn't take. They didn't really do a good job in this game displacing the sounds of the zombies. Like, I can't ever tell where they're coming from. I can hear them just fine. It's kind of hard to tell where they're coming from sometimes. There's a nuke. Is that max ammo with it too? Oh, we're going to get that. Oh, God! Yes! <laughs> Woo, that was close. That's how you deal with round number six. Onward to round seven we go. So, what's the first thing you're going to play when you get Black Ops 2? Is it going to be zombies? Is it going to be multiplayer? Is it going to be campaign mode? Is it going to be a new game mode inside multiplayer? I'm sure they're going to have some new game modes. We've already seen drop, drop zone, drop point, hold point, capture point, something point. Anyways, there's a new game mode that we know for sure. We've all seen it on multiplayer. Hard point. Hard point. That's the name of it. And then, of course, the new zombie mode is the 4v4 multiplayer. So, for me, I'm going to play zombies first. And since I'm getting the exclusive Nuketown Zombies 2025 map, I'll be playing that first. Uh, I'll probably post a few of those that night. And then, I guess, I'll do the campaign and then play some multiplayer. Campaign shouldn't take more than, like, six hours. They got really short campaigns. Probably finish the campaign in one sitting. Come on, zombies. Kind of burning through this ammo pretty quick.
Bad zombie. Stay back. Yells! 